success, charisma, and fame. This so is I a really PR expect- company in a box. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, PR company in a box. I did stretch for that one a little bit, didn't I? This is the Six of Wands, Queen of Wands, and World. I I love this combination. Yeah, because, again, we Earth. If you notice, the last card is an Earth card, so it's about the structure and the foundation, basically, of... More of than the, 15 minutes. Yeah, you know, more than 15 minutes, so you're not snooky. Success, you know, self-explanatory, the... Uh, the six of uh, of wands is, is is the victory card. It's achieving something. The charisma is having the ability to basically recreate yourself, and then of course, you know, and for people to be attracted to you, and then of course, the fame is uh, what it is that you need. My suggestion with all of these is get yourself a bottle of Crown of Glory oil, rub it all over all of them, just slather it in Crown of oh, Glory. Oh, that's what's um, that's what's the best about that Crown of Glory oil. Wait till we make a sun oil. Woo-hoo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have to come in next year. Yeah. <laughs> I'm still I'm still recovering from making all of these. <laughs> Three lines, yeah. So. It, again, this this has creating these and using the tarot cards within my spells has given me a, a better understanding or or a different level of understanding of the energy in the cards of how it's a living energy and it's mm-hmm. made my readings even much stronger. Yeah, it, it 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 really does, and you know the fun part for me was being able to to play with and manipulate those particular three card spreads in order to create the desired result that I want. And if you know, and knowing the stuff that I know about tarot, I knew where to put particular emphasis and where not to put particular emphasis, and really think about it when you're laying it down. And that's the main thing to really really think about it enormously. When you're laying it down, if you have a lot of people would think a great love spell would be three water cards in a row. No, it's not. There could be way too much. You know, that could be, end up being the biggest high maintenance, crazy psychopathic relationship you have ever seen in your entire life. And this is the things that Jackie and I were cognizant of when we created these particular spell kits. 